some yapping going on? Yes. No, there's not. No, there is not. Because if there is, nothing gets done. If nothing gets done, nobody can do business. If you don't do business, you don't make any money. 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 Right? So the more we all listen, the more we all work together, the more we're going to do business, the more money we're going to get. Yes. Yeah, right. Okay, so the, the first thing we were going to do, well, a couple of things that we're going to make sure we get done in this class. So we're going to get the president selected. Is that right? Yes. Very good. We're going to set up our committees, which I can see that your teacher here, Mr. Jets, or Craig, put out. All right. Then we're going to get our committee chairman. All right. We're going to describe a little bit about each committee. And then we're going to get started. Okay, one of the things we get started on is the things like promotions. Start letting people know where we're going to be doing our marketing, what we're going to be selling. All right, so first thing is, we need a president. And I understand we have how many nominees? Three. Three, perfect. Is everybody, who are the three nominees? Daniel, Paul, and Sarah. Daniel, Sarah, and Very good. So what we'll do, in alphabetical order, because it's a great opportunity. Let me tell you this. I'm in to I was in Toastmasters. And Toastmasters is a, is a well, you learn how to you do speeches, you do you learn how to evaluate, you learn how to do business meetings and, and uh, policy and procedures for business. And whenever you get an opportunity to speak, whether it's in front of your class, in front of your hockey team to be a leader, always try and take advantage of that opportunity. So for these three people, they're probably a little bit scared, a little bit anxious, and that's cool. But you know, the next time, you won't be as scared and anxious because you'll say, you know what, I remember that one time that I was here. And I can tell you that I, when I first gave my first speech in Toastmasters, I was, I was really nervous. All these people I thought were expert speakers and all that. But by the time I gave my tenth speech, I was really comfortable. And then whenever I go do business presentations, sometimes with your, Mr. Jensen here, we'd go together, like to Winnipeg we went, and we would do presentations, and I wasn't as nervous. And when you're not nervous, people see that as confidence. And people want to do business with confident people. All right? So always take advantage, whenever you can, to be a leader, whenever you can, to speak in front of somebody. Does that all make sense to everybody? Yeah. Like I can tell you, if I wasn't in Toastmasters and I hadn't done a lot of business presentations, I'd be really nervous about being up here. It's not that I'm a little, not a little bit nervous still. I just want to make sure you guys learn as much as I can, and I can share as much as I can with you properly. But I am not all nervous, so I keep forgetting what I'm going to say in things. All right, so congratulations for those three nominees. And in alphabetical order, my last name, Craig, who would be the first nominee then? Okay. I mean, no, Daniel. Daniel. Daniel, Daniel. Okay, so what, 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 what the rule is, is the person will come up here and speak, and it'll be no more than one minute, all right? What do I say? What do you say? Okay, I'll give you a few ideas what you should say. First of all, you, if you want to be the president of this company, first of all, again, it's a great honor. Because again, it's an opportunity to be a leader. And it's an opportunity for, ne for the next time if you own your own business, or in hockey, whatever, you'll have been a leader already. And you've been able to motivate people and communicate and work together as a team. So that's good. So what you want to do is tell them your name. What you want to do is tell them a little bit about maybe what experience you've had in working with a team, whether it's hockey or whether it's in school. And then maybe what little few ideas that you might have for the company. Like, we want to try to all work together. What we want to do is maybe earn, maybe for what charity, or just some different ideas you have. And then at the end, you always say, goes out an action statement at the end of your speech and say, please vote for, for me, Kirk Jensen, because uh, I'd like to be your president. All right? Everybody got an idea of that? All right, for the first nominee, Mr. Craig, can you introduce him, please? Basketball team and a volleyball team, and 
Yeah. I'm responsible. Ah, okay, smart. Thank you. And smart. I gave you that. He is pretty smart. Very good. I'm not. All right, the next one will be great. Oh, Mary. Oh! I am Pope Marin, as you all know. And I would love to be president because I love to be a leader. <laughs> and I play on the soccer team. My experience, and you did play baseball. I did play baseball, <laughs> and I would have lots of fun doing it. That is why you should vote for me. Yeah, I was last, um, yeah, I could be. Boy, you sure get a lot by just 
<laughs> so, Mr. Jensen, would you like to see your ballot heads down? One vote. Okay. Whatever. Uh, yeah. That's usually we do is see the ballot heads down. It's, it's just for efficiency. You have one vote. We have outside uh, Hope, Daniel, uh, William, and Sarah. Okay. Ready to vote? Put your head down. Good. Let's first start with Hope. Raise the hands who thinks Hope would be your best and most effective leader. Good. Now, let's talk a little bit more about uh, Daniel Gagnon. You know Daniel Gagnon's not my vote. Well, don't tell us that. It's like yeah. Exactly. Well, I'm just uh, what you would say. And hands down. Oh, oh, Smith. Oh. Okay. Come on in, Andrew. That's yes, right. Uh, your vote will be an abstain. Sarah Scott. Just put your hand Toastmasters, oh. in Toastmasters, 
I would actually tell people we all shake hands if they had a good handshake or not. We'd always critique it and make everybody better. So what she did a good handshake, first of all, what Hope was doing is she was kind of grabbing my hand like this. Now see how I have her fingers? She can't give me a good handshake anymore, right? Because she's only grabbed my fingers. She can't squeeze my hand. Because okay. so what you try to do is this piece right here. And what? Is connect there and then make your handshake. Very good. Much better. This? No. No. All right. So everybody does it where you just so that's what a good handshake is, everybody. It's not hard. Okay, it's not hard. Not hard. Right? It's, there's a difference between firm and hard. All right. Okay, up here I'm just going to bring him in uh, up to speed what we've decided. We've decided we're uh, fun. Oh, President. Oh, Could you bring up to speed? Oh, oh,
if we can put this feature in our software. Support would say this programming. We're having a lot of problems with our product on this part of the program. Can you fix it up a little better? So they would always talk and work together. And sales would talk to support. Guys, you are our number one reason why we have a lot of sales. Sales got to be good, but I can tell you, if you have a good support department, sales are easy. Because everybody talks about support. All the different clients out in Canada and around the world, all used to say, Jens has had great support. You want a good company that has good support, whether you're buying a product or you're buying a service. Do you guys want to give support here? Yes. Yes, yes. you do. Your teacher, Mr. Jensen, was part of our support and sales team. And he did a great job. A lot of people, if they had a problem, wanted to talk to Craig to fix it. Because Craig could relate really well with the end user, with the person that was actually using the computer. Tissue, please? Yeah. One big tear from Uncle Craig. <laughs> All right, so you can see how everybody kind of overlaps, and in the middle, all three overlap, right? So everybody helps each other. So this is the same thing here with sales. What would be on the part? Our part. Sales. We have marketing, promotions. And then we also like a, have merchandise. And again, setup is a little bit outside here, but sales can sometimes say, if you, like I think what we need is something like this, they can give ideas to set up, so we think we'll have more sales like this. And who oversees all of this? President. The president. Oh, C-H-O-P-E? The president. Ms. Hope. Okay, so each one of these things we're going to have in committees, and then within those committees, you talk about the chairman. your president. Very good. So what will happen is each committee will select a chairman that will be ratified or agreed upon by the president. Okay? Because the chairman has got to be able to work with the president, the president's got to be able to work with the chairman. Right? Jenna Nichols, please report All right. to the office. So, Jenna Nichols, let's start. Can you have James Davis and Chief Bruce Yes, I can. Thank you. Okay, so let's start with the setup department. Wow. Who would like to be on the setup department? One, two, three. Two. Two. Chase, I put Chase, I'll do it with you. Okay. <laughs> so we have five. We have five. Five guys. Five guys in front. Five strong boys. We're yes. strong. Okay, put up your hands nice and high, guys, so they can see. Five for sales. For sales? No, for sales. Not yet. Not yet. Yeah. Yeah. Seven. 
Alright. You forgot to leave. So is everybody that was standing in the in the uh, apartment now? Okay, because we'll probably come back, but that's great. So let's do now sales. Let's see you guys volunteer so so quickly. Yeah, that's really good, you guys. That's very, very good. Can I get your name? Please sit down. sure that everybody is assigned to bring something and, and they have deadlines when to bring it okay they will the ones that be in charge of making sure that it's brought what each person is going to bring because we don't want to say face paint and then nobody brings the face paint stuff right we don't want to see that we're bringing hot dogs and nobody brings the hot dogs so that's what the merchandising team does it's very important without a merchandise well, team we don't have anything to sell okay so how many do we have the merchandise you know, also, I believe from uh, Junior Achievement last year, we had some carryover money, some seed money for a couple hundred dollars. So merchandising, they'll say, we need to go get this. They'll get the stuff to buy, bring back receipts, like for the face paint and... Uh, hot dog. Hot dogs, all this kind of stuff. Mustard. Mustard. I'll do all the face painting at the dollar store for like two dollars. Yeah, so that's the thing, merchandising, you're right where you need to be. The dog store. Right. Okay, all right, so then the last one is here, bookkeeping. Who want to be part of bookkeeping? Bookkeeping book book is keeping track of the financial records. Oh, oh no. And we only need four for that. So here, I'll let you decide. Seven. Seven. President, you have to decide. Pezzy. Pezzy. President. 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 President.
and motion to mark it in here and finance here. And what I'd like you to do is select the chairman, all right? So everybody go to your committee. Okay. He has a body. Okay. 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 Okay
Okay. 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 Who is the chairman of the merchandise committee? Cindy. Very good. Oh yeah, she's not here. Oh. I just shake hands. Oh, okay. I heard. Hey, hold. In abstention. Is that okay? We have some chairman of the committee. She would love to. I know her. Yeah. yeah. She loves He's to be in good leader. Very good. Well, like, awesome. right. She'd be very happy. Our next committee was. Under your shoes. Promotions. Where am I? Oh, yes. Hey, hey, hey. Good choice. Congratulations. And then the chairman for sales. Hey, we just Oh, I like that. It's nice to be Hello. I was nice to And then for bookkeeping. Hello, Andrew. Andrew. Congratulations. Get a kisser. He wasn't going to do it, but you said it. Remember the eye contact Oh, but I was just like giving my head a kiss. Because I love myself. It was just the ring. I like the pull. Okay, well, congratulations yeah, to all the chairmen. And remember, too, that being a chairman is a very responsible position. Right? You're, you're also part of leadership. And you are a direct conduit as well to the president. So if you're having some issues, you can always talk to your president. All right? And president, you should always be checking with the different chairman, making sure it's, everything's going fine. And it also doesn't hurt, there's, there's, MBA is Master's of Business Administration. There's another, I, I used to like the, this degree, it's called MBWA. So when I was a president of my company, it was managed by walking around. So what I used to do is I used to go to the programmers, and not to the, the, the chief of the programming department, but I'd ask them, so how's it going? Are you happy? How's everything going for you? And it's amazing what you learn as a president or as a leader by just walking around and talking to quote unquote your soldiers and the people that are in the field. You will find out a lot about your company and how it's going by doing that. So that's an MBWA. That's that's kind of like by the street. A degree by the street. Okay, so can I have the president up here and the promotions chairman? What? Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. Alright, so what we're going to do, what's really important now, is we have got to start getting our message out to the school on what we're doing. Okay? So that's a big part of promotions and marketing. So what I want you to do is I want maybe, let's say, the president to ask the class different things that we should be doing and have the promotions manager writing down on the board all the ideas. Okay. For how do we, like, for example, posters, different ideas that we have to get the message out I to the does, school. Okay. I do So, I did, I did does anybody this. have any ideas to get a message out to
And that would be done, let's say, when? What's today? Tuesday? How about an announcement on Friday? Yeah. How about an announcement on Friday? Yes. Would we have to tell on June 5th, would we have to say to bring money? Like announce that. I wouldn't. What I'd just do is I'd just do a basic announcement. Because you're going to have more than one announcement. This year is just kind of announcing that you're having a an event. Yeah. The part that you have to name this event too. Junior achievements, charity fundraising type of things. Or animal fundraising. Okay, letters home. We don't want to do that right away, right? That will be something later, but we're just over. Kids talk to classes, yeah, three for four, yeah, that's good. Newsletter, how often does your newsletter come out? Two weeks. Every two weeks? Can we be in more than one newsletter? Yep. When does the next newsletter come out? Just came out, so probably be uh, May 15th. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we can work on that. We don't have to do that one right away, but we can do posters, get that started. Okay. PA announcements. And I think the other thing is we can kind of set timelines for. But I think the posters and the PA announcements and, and working on the announcement is something we can try to get done. The PA announcement by project. Yeah. And the posters to get started anyway. And, the okay. Okay. and then the other ones will set up set up other deadlines because we've only got what, two more minutes here, Craig? We just gotta rush in three minutes. A few minutes, so yeah. We want to kind of make sure we wrap this up. Sound good, Senator President? Madam Promotion Chair, that's your committee. Maybe we have and then we've got time a name for the company. Success. Well, you know what? Success. <laughs> what I would say is, why don't we do that? If you bring three names, everybody think of a name. Let's have three names for the next time we come and we'll have a vote. Right? Three names for what? The company. Right. That would be good. And right and set up guys, like you know, really there's nothing more than what I want to make sure is we get our promotions going and get it out there early so everybody's aware of it. Yeah. Six success. Six success. All right, well, you can bring it forward for next meeting, all right? Six success. No, but the other way. All right, I gotta tell you what. Those were 10 out of 10 handshakes that I just got there from home and your promotion chairman. That was, that was fantastic. Always work on, every time you shake hands, work on your smile, work on your eye contact, and work on your hand. Pretty good. So guys, I am very impressed. We've got our president, we've got our committees, we've got our chairman. We're moving forward with promotion. We are on our way with our company. Big hand for the company. Come get your uh, uh, simple. 
Bye. 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 See you later. Bye. Are you actually videoing this? I'm actually videotaping. Yes, we are. Mm.